much this is. Now I've got pretty small hands, but that's just a little bigger than the palm of my hand. And yet the speaker on this is Bose quality sound. You cannot beat it. And because it's Bluetooth, so many of the new TVs today are Bluetooth. Now you can put this right next to a pillow and listen to TV late at night and not have to be concerned about waking your partner or spouse. And if you love music, you'll never get a cell phone that sounds as good as this. You met Brett Hamilton earlier. We were talking about how to save photos. Oh, let me do real quick colors because I still have a few. Here's the black. That is the stone blue. And then we also have the white smoke. I had other colors, they're already gone. Uh, our QVC price on this is, is about 20% more normally. Let's bring Brett back in. Uh, Brett, in his earlier life, uh, did radio work, <laughs> disc jockey work. Do you remember that first, first time you ever got to pair, put a pair of Bose headphones on your head? First time? I do. Yeah. yeah, I remember it because all of a sudden I heard music uh, in a whole different way. And I know that sounds like an exaggeration. I know it sounds like, hey, is it really going to be that different? It was. It still is. I mean, headphones, in-ears, speakers. But the fact that Bose can give you something as small as this and as portable as this that still sounds good and lets you listen, Gibson stand not included, lets you listen to your music anywhere you want to go, pretty wild. But the bass... Just the, just the bass on it alone says a lot about the oomph that this thing is capable of, of generating. One other really cool thing about this, Dan, well, there's a lot of cool things about it. It's got this little strap on the back, which means that, I'll hit the music for a second, means that you can put this anywhere you want. You could strap it to a uh, bike handle, to a yep. backpack, to a beach chair, Golf to cart. whatever, to your handbag, and, and kind of take the music and share it with everybody. Make sure it's music everybody likes. Um, <laughs> But, but the, the portability of it is nice, but the, the sound, of course, is, is, is the big one. And what's even better is that it's 100 bucks. <laughs> I yeah. mean, to be able to get anything from Bose without spending a few hundred dollars is, is typically unheard of. It's surprisingly room-filling sound from a small box. I, I yeah. truly believe our younger generation has had to suffer through the very worst sound reproduction of any generation since probably the 50s because everybody's got their cell phone but the speaker on a cell phone is is tinier than my little fingernail so you yeah. get no bass response you don't get you hear the music but you don't get to feel it with this and this is the magic of Bose and their sound engineers in a very small space they created very big sound and that means yeah. a complete ability to capture low notes mid-range high-end without it ever sounding tinny. There's only one company that I can think of in the world that when you hear it, you recognize the manufacturer. Does that, that I know that doesn't make sense if you've never experienced it. I told this story real quick, Brett. Uh, I walked into my dentist's office, and this has been a long time ago, a few years before the pandemic, and they had bought a Bose Wave music system, and I said, to the receptionist, I go, oh, when did you get the Bose Wave music system? She goes, how do you know it's a Bose? I said, because I can tell. You can hear it. Because it was yeah, just that, so rich. This captures that, almost that same level in a tiny little package. Yeah, it, it's a different sound. It's a different feel. Like you said, it's a different warmth to it. But, but what's cool about what Bose does is that you can listen to the music at, at a very low volume, very quiet, or blast it, and it's going to sound good no matter what. I mean, typically, I think growing up, we had all these, all this equipment. We had, you know, big speakers, and we had the tuner and the amplifier and the record player and all this other stuff. And it sounded good at at one level, but then others kind of sounded ah, a little muddy or whatever that might be. Bose gives you the ability to be able to enjoy that music at at any level, but also kind of auto tunes itself. And by that, I don't mean faking. I mean uh, equalization is probably a better term. It, it'll modify what it needs to do on the inside based on the type of music that you're playing. So you can go from playing country to playing rock to playing uh, classical to playing whatever you listen to. And it will do all the work for you, which is nice. But what's even nicer is that you don't need to know anything about the technology that's yep. inside. One other, one other cool part about it, if I can real quick, the, the buttons on the front um, allow you to do everything with the touch of, of one button. You've got uh, the plus and minus, which is your volume. And then uh, if we could just show the close up for a second, there's a there's a button in the middle. And um, OK, there's right there. that little button right there in the middle. 
will allow you to play if you hit it one time. That same button hitting a second time will allow you to pause. And then you can also, once you're playing, hit it two times and it'll skip ahead, hit it three times, and it jumps back to where it was. So without knowing anything about what's inside there or how it all works, all you have to do is find that multi-function button, hit play, hit pause, and you're on your way. Also, there are microphones inside here, and the microphones will allow you, if you're connected to a, a phone, to your cell phone, if your phone rings, the music will automatically pause, and if you choose to answer the call, you hit that little multi-function button in the middle, that will answer the call, and that same multi-function button will allow you to hang up. Uh, last thing I'll say about it, it talks to you when you first turn it on, yep. and it will help you uh, find your, your Bluetooth connection. You hit the power button. All right, then if you're not connected already, you just hit the little uh, Bluetooth button on the side there, and that Bluetooth will then make the speaker and the phone talk to each other. It's called making it discoverable, but it will connect inside the Bluetooth option on any of your devices. One thing I'll say about the TV real quick, you mentioned at the beginning, you have to be careful because sometimes um, with Bluetooth TVs, there will be a little bit of latency, meaning the lip flap. So the lips may not match the sound. Uh, okay. If you're watching a sporting event or you're trying to fall asleep at night or whatever, but yes, it will connect to any Bluetooth enabled device uh, and it will make whatever you're listening to sound a heck of a lot better than it does right now. Richer, deeper. Yeah. Uh, it's also completely battery rechargeable. So yeah. you get to listen to your music wherever you happen to be without having to worry about constantly feeding batteries. Do you remember when the disc man came out, Brad? <laughs> I still have one. I, I haven't used it. I, I couldn't get rid of it. I just, yeah, but I do. My, I, I, my, could, I could rant about that all day, yeah. My favorite <laughs> button was the shuffle button. <laughs> it, it would randomly you never knew select. It would play. You never knew yeah. what it was going to play. Out of the six songs on that CD, right. you were always yeah. surprised at which one it played. That was, yeah, well, shuffle. Well, one thing I'll say about that real quick before we run out of time. When, when the Discman was out or the Walkman or whatever it was, all you could listen to that day was whatever was on that tape or that what CD. What you carried with you, but, yep. What you carried with you. Now, if you've got one of these... You can find, without exaggeration, pretty much any song, song that was ever recorded. Yeah. Ever. And you just need to know where to look for it, and a lot of it's free. So we have access to so much more than ever before, and a chance to rediscover those songs. Songs from way back will still sound better than they did even back then, because now you can finally replicate that sound from the studio. I truly believe that I, I probably wouldn't have made it through the pandemic and through this holiday season with Amen any sense of being positive, had it not been for music. Yeah. Uh, I still, I crank the music when I do housework. Uh, or if I'm Which out in the Which is what, garage. twice a year? Well, yeah. Is that twice a year, the housework? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or if I'm out in the garage and I'm working on, on yeah. one of the hot rods, uh, yeah. the music gets turned up. And I, I think we forget that. Yeah. Uh, you gotta, you gotta play music so that you feel it. Yeah. It, well, and you need the right equipment to do that. Well, and, and music's a good trigger. You know, it can really bring you up when you're down. It can, it can mellow you out after a crazy day, and you're just like, ah, I just need something. To, but it's a great companion, too. I can't be in a quiet house. You know, Meg works from home a few days a week, and she's also, she uh, teaches at a cyber school, so they yep. go into the building. And when I'm here by myself, there's music throughout the entire house. I can't be in a quiet space. And sometimes I'll put earbuds in versus a speaker. Yeah. That way I walk room to room or whatever it is in the house and it kind of follows me. But yeah, outside, inside, wherever in the car, I don't. I, I can't be someplace where it's quiet. This is awesome. Under a hundred bucks. I still have the black, a, a few of the white, that's called white smoke, and then the stone blue. Brett, uh, I'll see you a little bit later on this afternoon, my friend. Thank you so much. All righty for your help Take and care. your assistance. Uh, we're gonna wrap okay. up another hour here on Q2. Uh, don't go anywhere, I'm coming back. Would you agree that this is the best time of year for TV? I think it is. We got some big sporting events that are coming up, like Daytona and the NFL. Uh, a lot of new series are starting off with, with additional programming. I've got a TV that is awesome. And wait till you see the sizes that are available. I'll show you that next. Come on back.